What would you do if you see a snake while walking a path? Hi, I'm Kinzan Gelso and I'll be telling you a story about a man who has been studying what most people get freaked out with, the reptiles in Amphibi and Sopotan. This is Jimmy and he's a herpetologist in Bhutan. As a child, he had seen people determined in killing snakes or lizards without knowing or understanding the nature of the reptiles and amphibians. He then decided to take this as a challenge in studying herpetology. Hailing from Pemagatsal, Jigmi has travelled length and breadth of Bhutan, conducting studies and researches on reptiles and amphibians. The species which is most ignored and even killed has now someone for its rescue. Bhutan has 90 plus snakes, close to 40 species of lizards, 7 species of tortoise and, and turtles, and then 78 species of frogs and tots that we call anurans in one group. The legendary leaders of past and present have protected and preserved the pristine natural environment of Bhutan, opening ample of opportunities for research and studies. The future of Bhutanese herpetology is bright in that we have a lot of new species to discover, we have a lot of areas to explore. In future, herpetology can add to the biodiversity of the country and serve as one of the pillars of conservation. Unfortunately, the interest shown in studying this discipline is so rare that Jimmy lands up doing everything by himself. No conservation entities are interested in either studying herpetology or funding his studies. So his passion could not get sufficient importance which it deserves. We do need funds to do the survey and, and to have uh, scientific documents for the species we are doing. But uh, I think none of the uh, conservation agencies or the government agencies have priority on snakes or lizards or frogs or even uh, the critical endangered tortoise and turtles. So uh, if there are support, it will be uh, good for us. He has no choice but to lean on young students of CNR in assisting him in conducting research. Jigme has lots of dreams and aspirations in expanding this field of studies in the country and in international platforms of herpetology. So next time you see a snake while crossing a path, you exactly know what to do. 